What's up guys, Andre here. So it's been a little while since we uploaded a video, but I don't know if you guys remember, we put a video up probably about, well, actually a year ago now, of our beautiful granddaughter Alani's birth. And um, today we are celebrating her first birthday, her one year birthday, guys. She's one years old, our little princess. So we wanna do a little video of her birthday celebration and we want to bring you guys along with us. So guys, come on, let's go on a birthday journey celebrating Princess Alani's first birthday, guys. I can't believe it's been a year, guys. Time just definitely flies by, you know? So she, um, we're looking to have a great time, guys. So let's go, guys, and let's get into this party for Princess Alani because the weather is cold in Western New York. So we had to do a um, party, but we had to rent a hall for this party. So guys, it's gonna be a great time. I'm excited. I can't believe it's been a year. So let's go, guys, on a journey. So here we are, fam. We got the balloons up just so the guests can know that the party is over here. And you walk in, it's very, very nice, very beautiful here. They got the, um, Holly got the time capsule box. So someone could write a little note, a little message for Alani. And when she turned 18, she could read them. As if you can see, the theming is Moana, her favorite, 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 favorite show, her favorite cartoon. And you got the leaves there when you first walk in. This is nice, guys. And then you walk in to this beautiful, beautiful party. Isn't that beautiful, guys? So, you know, you walk and you're gonna have the food station here and it smells absolutely delicious. It smells absolutely amazing. And then when you come from the food station, you have the drink station right here and looks absolutely just fantastic. And then you got the table set up here. Of course, Moana, um, got the balloons and so, they did a great job. Alexia and Holly made the centerpieces for the tables. Got a table there, table there. Got a table here, guys. A table here, fam. So we are excited about it. And then this is the table for the princess. Got her balloon set up and she is one. And then check this out. Check out the candy table. Got a nice candy table. And look at that beautiful cake. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? And then on each television screen is four big screens at the top. They're gonna play uh, Moana throughout the whole party. And um, yeah, and these are like, they made like little decorations of the year she from her from one month all the way to her 12th month which is this month isn't that nice and then check this out check this out she's one and this is going to be her photo op station where she take photos right isn't that beautiful fam so I just wanted to get a video of it and they got the balloons in the window with um, Hey Hey and the different Moana characters. So, and also we do have a little, not much of a big PlayStation, but an area for the kids can kind of play little games and things like that and um, little capsules and like a little little ball um, section and they can put a little bowl in. So there it is, guys. When everybody come, I will try to do some recording of the event. All right. Here comes the bir birthday princess. Say hi, Marianne. It's her party. Her says she can cry if she wants to. Uh -huh. Okay, hold her hand. Come on. Hold her hand. Come on. You guys come on. Come on, guys. Uh oh. Look at them two cousins. Uh oh. 
She said, I'm gonna go by myself. She wanna play. She playing? She spotted the play session. Lonnie. I wanna go play. Lonnie. It's your birthday. Lonnie. Lonnie. How old are you? How old are you? Yay! Are you one? Are you one? She looking, checking everything out. Oh. Hi, Papa, baby. Uh -oh. uh, you can play with the ball. Hi, <laughs> Say hi. Lorelai, say hi. Lorelai, say hi. Say hi, Papa. Oh, Lonnie. <laughs> hi, Papa okay. Princess. You gotta take that out your mouth. And here's the delicious meal. You got some rolls, butter, beautiful salad, salad dressing. You got carrots, ziti pasta, mashed potatoes. You got chicken and roast beef with the fixings. So we are about to enjoy. Birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Alani. Happy birthday to you. How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? Say what? Say what? Go ahead. Kick it. Kick it. Kick it. so precious. <laughs> Everyone was having a great time, dancing like no one was watching. I mean, Alani was having a wonderful first birthday celebration. Awesome time. Let's go to Disney. What's up, fam? So we had a wonderful time at the party. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, but we are now a quick turnaround. We went home from the party, got ourselves together, jumped up three, four hours later to the airport. And now let me show you where we are, fam. 
we are about to enter Hollywood Studios. And guys, it's nine, uh, what time is it, Holly? 9.17 9.17 a.m. And here's the line to get into Hollywood Studios. So we're gonna bring on a journey with us. We're celebrating all week for our beautiful granddaughter Alani's first birthday. So we are on our way to Hollywood Studios. Guys, let's go on a journey. Let's do it. Right. We parked the vehicle and we are on our way in to celebrate Princess Alani here at Hollywood Studios. Now we know it's great, great guys. So um, I can't really tell how, how crowded it is right now. I know that's what a lot of people talk about during this time of season to come. You know, spring break, kids are out of school. So, but we'll see. We're gonna make the best of it though. You know, we just come in to take a slow, um, you know, adventure through the parks and just enjoy ourselves and eat some good snacks and get on some rides. And just, it's just so awesome being here in Disney. And so guys, come on, go on a journey. Guys, you ready to get, you ready to go on a journey, Alexia? Yeah, yeah. What about you, How? I'm ready to go, let's do it. Let's do it, guys. So I'm gonna walk you in and I don't know, you do look like it. it's pretty crowded, but let's see. Let's see, guys. So the lines are way back here, and you can see it's coming all the way and curving around. This is definitely gonna be a busy day. Busy, but magical day, nevertheless. Wow. It's not bad, the weather's not bad, it's breezy, the sun is shining. So, hey, listen, when you at Walt Disney World, there's no bad days in my opinion. So guys, let's go. Let's see if we can get into the park and we'll come back on as soon as we get through this long line here. Hey guys, we made it through the park entrance and woo, check it out. It is some Disney goers here today. So we, the walking we've been doing and the crowds being in where they are, guys, a great amount of people here. We got a little appetite going. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go get something to eat at ABC Commissary. So guys, let's go get something to eat and we're gonna bring you guys with us. So um, I like that. Um, how you like the, the uh, buffalo chicken um, sandwich with the fries? It's usually a, um, a family pleaser for us. So guys, I don't know how you ever had it, but Let's go check it out, guys. But again, beautiful day here at Hollywood Studios. So we're gonna go and get some grub because we're a little famished. Um, but beautiful day, we're having an awesome time. Um, it's just to celebrate, guys. So let's go get something to eat and let's see if I can get me some kind of um, nice cold beverage. Because I do got my sweater on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come out of my sweatshirt and, um, you know, prepare for this nice weather here in Florida. Let's go, guys. Okay, guys, we are at ABC Commissary. So I got the um, grilled chicken sandwich. Mine is the avocado sauce. There it is. And I got extra of avocado. I got mail on mine. So go ahead, guys. You get the first bite. Go ahead. Open up. Ah, there you go. Now I'm going to give it a try. It got um, lettuce, tomato, um, bacon, and provolone cheese on it also. I don't know if you can see it. All right. Mm. It's pretty good. Chicken breast is a tiny bit on the dry side, but not really bad. Um, but I put a little mayo on it, and that kind of even things out a little bit, but it's really delicious. It's good, and of course, you can't go wrong with the fries. Come on, guys, there you go. Get it right. All right. That's pretty good, guys. I've been hollering Alexia. They got the buffalo chicken, but um, they both agreed that it was delicious. Okay, guys? So. ABC Commissary, stop on by guys, check it out. They have great food here. And what we did was, we tried to come for the crowds get really, really busy, but 
little tip. If you want to eat inside here, come in and grab yourself a table, then mobile order. You got your table secure, then go get your food, and you ain't got to worry about not having anywhere to sit, right? All right, guys. We're going to finish eating, and we're going to go get on Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Let's go. Okay, guys. Now it's time for Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. How many of you guys like that ride, guys? I mean, it's one of our favorites. It's, we definitely missed a great movie ride, but you know what, though? This is a really good ride. It kind of immerses you in the cartoon. If you like this ride, guys, tell me what you think. Leave a comment below. So let's go, guys. I'm going to take you with us on Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Let's go. I also found R2-D2. Oh, yes. train? Yeah. Excuse me, you there. Who, me? Do you mind helping these good people into the cartoon want to fix this here locomotive?
with it being spring break, the crowd's really not as bad as I thought it would be at first. Sometimes you can get a little, um, from an optics perspective, when you see that crowd, you know, remember we came in at like nine in the morning and it was a line to get in and a whole, a line driving in rather, and a line when you got in. But now it seemed like a regular, normal, busy day. Nothing overcrowded or over, you know, um, populated with people because of the um, spring break. But like some of the wait times are like 60 minutes. Um, Slinky Dog, 60 minutes. Um, also, um, Mickey and Minnie was 60 minute wait times. So the wait times are not too, too bad guys, but it's snack time. And I'm going, I'm here at the market and I'm going to get the Num Num cookie. It's something that we share every time we come because it's a big cookie if you ever had it. Um, too much, well, it's not too much for me, but we try to share now. So I'm going to get the Num Num cookie guys. We're going to continue to eat some snacks and um, get on some rides and we're going to bring you guys right along with us. So just wanted to give you that little, my little observation as far as the crowds go today. Okay guys, snack time. So I stopped and I got the Num Num cookie uh, at the marketplace stand right there um, and going towards um, Toy Story Land. So there it is. Um, it's not warm, but they serve them to you warm, but I had it out for a little while, but let me just give it a try. It's always very delicious every time I get it. So let's try it out and see. Hmm. Even though it's not really warm, but it's still soft, gooey and gooey. Let's take a look, guys. It's delicious. I'm gonna share it with my family, but you gotta get the Num Num cookie whenever you come to Hollywood Studios, guys. It's absolutely delicious, fam. All right, we're gonna keep on eating. We got dinner later on this evening. Gonna bring in the dinner with us and um, see what kind of offers they have. We're gonna go to Mama Melrose today. We haven't been there in a while, but Mama Melrose tonight for dinner here at Hollywood Studios. Mama Melrose. Okay, family, so we're still here at Hollywood Studios. 
We're about to get ready to go out to have dinner at um, uh, Mama Melrose. It's been a little while since we've been to Mama Melrose. We always love their food. We always get the steaks. So guys, you know, the weather is cooling off a little bit here. Um, it's not too bad. The crowds are actually thinning out. Great time, great day. I mean, we got on some great rides and we ate some snacks as you guys seen the treats we had. Uh, we had a wonderful time. And so we're gonna right now get ready, like I said, to prepare for dinner. We're gonna bring you guys with us just in case you ever come here and you're wondering about Mama Melrose. I don't know if you ever eaten here before. If so, leave us a comment below. Let us know what you thought of their food. And um, you know, let us know your opinion. So we're gonna get ready to take you guys along with us while we have dinner. I'll show you the menu and different things of course we'll show you our meal show you what we have and um yeah we're celebrating um all week long we're celebrating our little alani's first birthday guys so it's to celebrate so let's go continue to go on this journey guys and let's go eat because i'm telling you when you walk around these parks and you you know you people watching and you sometimes you sit down and people watch i don't know if you guys do that but i sit down and people watch and you know we had such a busy day yesterday with the party and then you know, got a couple hours of sleep, had to get on a flight, come here. So we are really running on adrenaline. I'm telling you, we haven't even been to our hotel yet because um, we just got the rental car and came straight to the park. And so, you know, we're a little tired, but man, I tell you, you know, once you get in these parks though, you sit down, you can take your little power nap or whatever, but once you get going, you know, you just go and make the best of it. And you know, that's what we're doing guys. So, you know, having a great time and I, you know, I hope you guys, if you're still here, give this video a thumbs up. I would definitely appreciate it. And, um, you know, I hope you guys like the video. And, you know, we just want to kind of show you around a little bit and show you what we're doing to celebrate Princess Alani's first birthday, guys. So I'm hungry. I'm always hungry. I'm ready to go eat, guys. So let's go. So just so you know, guys, when you go down near Pizza Rizzo, Pizza Rizzo is here. Mama Mel was straight ahead, but you know, if you're waiting for your reservation, you can have their seats here when it's open. There's also seats over here where you can wait until your um until your reservation is up. So that's what we're doing. We're sitting here waiting until our reservation is available. And then we're gonna go and eat. So I wanted to point that out to you that you know, because when you go around near the restaurant, it's benches there, but they're packed, you know. Generally they're packed with people. So just wanted to let you know that there is areas where you can rest and wait for your reservation. So we are heading in, guys, to our table. So here's the menu, guys. Check it out. Here's the appetizers, and here's the entrees. Back of the menu, I have your wine flights, your specialty drink, your sparkling, white wines, whatever you like. Here's the bread service, guys. I just brought the bread out. It looks delicious. It's nice and warm, and they also brought a ton of butter for us. So we're going to try this bread and see what we think. Hey guys, here's our butter bread. It's nice and warm. Take a bite. Go ahead. You get the first bite. Open up. A little bigger. A little bigger. There you go. Now I want to try it. Mmm. Just as delicious as I remember from before. Nice and airy. Crusty on the outside. Chewy on the inside. They also give you oil for your bread, but I like the butter instead. So far, the butter is absolutely, and the bread is delicious. What do you think, Holly? This is really good, nice and fresh. It is a little different. It used to be a little harder on the outside, the bread that we used to get, but it's really good. I like it. Pretty good, right? Yeah. Okay, guys, here's our steaks. We all got the same thing, steak and macaroni and cheese. And we're gonna try it, and we're gonna tell you what we think of it, right, Lex? All right, we're gonna get into it. And we also Thank got you. more bread, so you can't go wrong. I'll bring some steak knives. Hey guys, I want to taste my steak. It looks delicious. It looks like it got some kind of sauce on it. I'm gonna taste it without the sauce first. I mean, they cut pretty easy. It's a little thin, but let's try it. 
Get the first bite, guys. Go ahead. There you go. very tasty. It's not over seasoned. It's very good. It's tender. Not too much chew to it. You taste the sauce that's on top of it. The sauce is like a ketchup base. Almost got like a um, celery type taste to it, but it's really good. How about this mac and cheese? Hey guys, there you go. Go ahead, get it. Okay, not my time. Mm. Very delicious. Probably the best macaroni tea I think I've ever tasted on Disney property. It's garlicky, it's super creamy. It's very good, guys. I love it. We're gonna eat and tell you what we think about everything towards the end, okay? Okay guys, there you have it. That was our day here at Hollywood Studios. You had a good time? I had an amazing time. Guys, we had a great time celebrating Princess Alani's birthday. Oh, we sure I have. mean, it was awesome from the ride. She enjoyed Mickey and Minnie so much. She from did. meeting the characters, so Mickey cute. and Minnie. And then the one part with Mickey, when we walked away, she cried. So Mickey came back playing peekaboo with her. So that just <laughs> made, that just gave us joy. So that's a day in the books. And how about dinner? What do you think of Mama Melrose, huh? It was good. We haven't been in a while since um, after everything opened up after the pandemic. Um, it wasn't the best meal that I've ever had, but it wasn't the worst either. It was good. I, it, I was give good. It, it was good. The steak was a little, a little bit um, on the tough side. I didn't care for the sauce too much but that you know it didn't really affect me either way right. but it was good the thin the steaks were really kind of thin right so which was surprising because they usually give you them juicy ones so i don't know if that's something new but the mac and cheese was off the chain the rolls were off the chain our server was great so yeah. mo, mo mo was awesome so, was good. but my, I mean, alexi and i thought it was really good I give it, I would say, a 7 out of 10. Yeah. Um, my steak was a little bit more tender than Holly's, and uh, the macaroni and cheese is excellent. So, guys, but that's our opinion, guys. You come, and you may, your, right. your taste buds may be different from ours, Absolutely. guys. So, nevertheless, guys, thanks for going on a journey with us. We appreciate you hanging out with us today. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe and hit that bell for future videos and future notifications. And that will do it from our, our birthday celebration of our beautiful granddaughter, Alani from here at Hollywood Studios, right? That's right. Okay, guys, see you next time. Peace. Remember, love one. Guys, love one a long time ago.